So the singularity, the Big Bang happens everywhere in an infinite space at once, where all of these squares on this infinite grid uh, go to zero size at finite past time, and the universe gets an infinite density. So the Big Bang the, uh, is in an infinite, hot, dense, homogeneous universe popping into existence all at once. Yeah, and it's not at the a same point. Time. It's, it's infinite. It's a boundary in everywhere. time. Right. Yeah. Uh, but it, I think a lot of people, you know, who aren't astronomers and cosmologists tend to imagine there is like a location somewhere in the universe where the yeah, Big Bang where, happened. Yeah, like, like an explosion and everything flew out right, away from it. Right, which is hot spot. We all go yeah. there one day, but this is where the Big Bang happened. But that's No, it but in fact, so uh, if we sit here and we look out, it, the further out in time we look, the, fur, the, fur, the further out in space we look, the further back in time we see, the Big Bang is actually, from our point of view, a sphere with us at the center. So it's actually a remarkably sort of Aristotelian universe that we end up with, where we actually are at the center of the universe and the outer edge of it. That you know, the 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 empire, the sphere that separates us from the Empyrean realm is uh, is actually the Big Bang, right? And we sit, sit yeah. at the center of that. And in fact, everyone, every observer, every observer in the is... universe sees himself at the center of their own universe. That's right, yeah. <laughs> which is also true of a lot of social media <laughs> and stuff as well. <laughs> so, um, but those singularities in a standard Big Bang cosmology, the, those singularities happen at finite past time you can calculate and that when we say the universe is 13.8 billion years old that's what we mean is that zero time point that we infer from our current expansion happened that long ago so that's almost kind of a problem because i think if you ask you know not go to a school and you talk about cosmology the question you inevitably get is what caused the big bang why was there a big bang and and this is another kind of problem that i think inflation touches right. on 